You ready? Yeah. Where you want, where you want to come in? <laughs> when are you, when are you get ready for that? I said I was ready, but I didn't know what to do. <laughs> when I go, well, I don't know, just come in. <laughs> heard is something I use a lot in my intros on these YouTube videos and sometimes background music and I use it a lot I probably overuse it but that's okay it's one of my favorites not because of the tune itself but because of the people involved um, the people playing that music was yours truly on the rhythm guitar and um, a gentleman by the name of WC Westmoreland who um, buddy was a buddy of mine that's since passed on. Um, way back in the early days of Hee Haw, he was on that that TV show. I remember seeing him. He was a young redheaded banjo picker, and he would uh, when the camera would go to him, he'd always roll his eyes or cross his eyes. He'd always cross his eyes and kind of roll his eyes, just acting up, being a nut. Uh, he was a fun-loving guy, and uh, he passed away a few years ago, and. Uh, the other gentleman in this uh, in that music track was a dear friend of mine by the name of James A. Perkins. He played the mandolin, and boy, he could pick the thunder out of that thing, I'll tell you. Um, anyway, we lost Jim back in uh, 2010 or early 2011, I believe January 2011, and... Uh, Aside from my own father, there is not another man in my life that I miss as much as I miss old Jim Perkins. I just want him back, you know, and I can't have him back. But uh, I have some wonderful memories of playing music with him. I'm going to play a couple more little clips here, and then I'll tell you why I'm doing this, uh, this video. All right, hang on. Yeah, you can shut up. That's where 
Okay, uh, the purpose for this video is I'm trying to gather a bit of information for my sister, my adopted sister, uh, call her sis. Uh, Jim's widow is putting together a little kind of a shadow box she's making uh, for her daughter as a Christmas present and it will include as you see here uh, Jim's photo when he was in the Air Force and one of his dog tags and a medal there's a couple of medals or maybe it's a two pieces to a medal I was not in the military I don't know about these things and that's why I'm about to ask you folks for some help um, also is his uh, or, or his military issue uh, New Testament I guess um, I wonder if they still do that I doubt it the way the world is today but uh, I could be wrong I hope I am anyway uh, someone who is in the military I have a question for you when sis was gathering up these items to put in this uh, little shadow box she's gonna recess that New Testament back into that styrofoam and uh, attach everything and then put it in a frame under glass but she found uh, these items on the right there that metal I'd call it a metal I don't know it's a, a ward of some kind um, and there were a couple of little bars in this box of stuff and she didn't know if it was something that had come off of that top bar there right under his photo or um something that went somewhere else on the uniform uh we don't know so i'm going to show them to you now it's a couple of little silver bars about a little over half inch long i guess and i put an ink pen in there just for reference so you can kind of see the size and someone if you if you can tell me what those little bars are for or if they're supposed to be a part of this uh, of what you see here or if they were attached on the collar or the sleeve or something uh, in the uniform uh, she just wants to know whether whether or not to include these little bars in this uh, shadow box that she's she's making for her daughter as a Christmas present I appreciate anybody's input on that any help we can get on that and I will let her know um, and we'll go from there so thank you all so much uh, appreciate all of you who watch these videos I am I am overwhelmed and humbled by the the number of subscribers that, that this channel has oh I, I know it's not big time like like some of these guys out there but for me just a little old hillbilly you know banging around in a little old workshop um, I, like I said I'm humbled and uh, I appreciate all of you and appreciate whatever input uh, y'all can give me on these little silver bars that'll be the end of the video thanking you all in advance <laughs> <laughs>